Good morning guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Winnie Khasmeni. If you're new here, welcome, welcome. Um to those who have always been here, my day ones. Um, thank you so much for watching another video. Today is Monday. I think you can hear by my energy, by my voice. <laughs> but it's already a blue Monday. Um, the time is quarter to 10 in the morning. I just got to work. Um, I had a viewing this morning. We might be moving soon. So, yeah. I'm excited but anxious all at the same time. I don't know how I'm feeling. I've been feeling very down lately, to be honest. I haven't been feeling like vlogging either. I'm just going through, you know, I don't know, a lot of things. So just trying to figure everything out and just, yeah. But anyway, um, we are good. I'm okay. We're not good, but we're okay. We're alive, we're grateful to God for giving us another day today and blessing us and waking us up in the morning because that's important you know tomorrow is never guaranteed um so yeah we're here today and we're grateful for that and because of that today is going to be a good day okay um yeah i think that's gonna happen i don't want to just vlog when i'm all excited when things are good i want to be able to basically i use my youtube almost as like a dear diary you know just whatever i'm feeling i want to journal it be present i guess record it um and yeah i mean we all have good days and bad days so it wouldn't make sense to just record the good days and pretend like life is perfect when it's actually not anyway <laughs> anyway today's gonna be a good day it's monday um yeah fingers crossed um that we do get the place um then it's gonna be another process of moving we've got a lot of furniture in storage and yeah i don't know if i'm looking forward to that worst part i think the worst thing for us is that we don't have any family in cape town so everything we need to do we basically have to do ourselves or shame we've got great friends who are always willing to help so yeah we might be moving this weekend um i don't know if i'm gonna be able to take some time off from work and sort that out um but yeah we'll see i'll bring you guys along on the journey if we do you know it's gonna be hectic it's probably gonna be like all over the place to be honest um, you know how it is it takes a couple of weeks to settle in to be honest and yeah but everything else other than that is good um i just got myself some coffee from um, coffee from mug and bean and i got myself some lunch as well and breakfast because i'm not planning on getting out the whole day until when i need to go fetch my kids which is late in the afternoon so i didn't want to order as well every time i try to order food on these delivery apps i end up taking 30 minutes to an hour trying to figure out what exactly do i want to eat and then you look at the prices which are ridiculous and then you end up looking at the delivery fee then you're just like should i just drive and go buy it myself but then you've got so much work or you're lazy you're just like so this morning i was like since i'm getting coffee i'm gonna get breakfast and lunch at the same place that's it okay um yeah guys it's gonna be i don't know i'm looking forward to the new month march um we'll see what it brings again literally i'm gonna take it one day at a time one step at a time um my nails are starting to outgrow a little i'm thinking of going to refill they're not bad I'm like i don't know if you can see they're not bad 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 you know um it's been two weeks so i don't know if i should go do a refill or a completely new set or should i just push through with it for now like it's really not that bad so i'll see and obviously finances are going to be very tight when anything that has to do with moving means spending money okay so and obviously having to pay double deposit like just moving is a lot guys okay so i might not i don't want to waste money on 
unnecessary things to be honest at this point i need to save every bit of money that we can get um yeah but anyway i'm in the office again today um i might show you and if we do get the place fingers crossed i might show you an empty apartment um thingy um empty apartment tour whatever it's a really cute little um apartment cute small enough for us for a family of four um so i'm gonna bring you guys along and show you that if i can but i'll let you know i'll keep you updated i'll keep you posted every step of the way okay <laughs> yeah guys so i hope you guys have a fantastic day i hope wherever you are um watching this puts a smile on your face justin j by seeing me okay just smile do it for me <laughs> um yeah i hope you have a good day i hope you have a productive week ahead i hope everything that you pray for everything that you want everything that you're trying to work towards um you know becomes fruitful and comes into existence basically whatever we for now so 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 you know whether it's health wise financially emotionally whatever it is that your heart desires may this week or the next couple of weeks may it manifest in jesus mighty name amen <laughs> guys life life is a lot life is a lot but forward move we move right we keep pushing guys um so today is friday the last time i spoke to you guys was on monday um yeah and since then i've been off sick at work and then yeah the doctor booked me off but i am on meds so we are in the process of healing and um since i spoke to you the last time we did get a place thank the lord jesus um and i'm so excited i'm so relieved that's like one stress um off my list to be honest and yeah we're looking forward to making great memories here as a family and i can't do the apartment tour there's literally things all over the floor boxes plastic bags clothes so the kitchen is the only place that um is looking decent <laughs> hence i'm standing here um, but yeah, we've got a cute little two-bedroom apartment, two bathrooms. You know, the girls have their room and then their bathroom. Then it's our bathroom and our bedroom. Little dining area and kitchen. So we're super grateful for that. Um, I think one thing this whole journey of trying to find a place has taught me is to definitely live within your means and, you know, just stay in your lane, honey. <laughs> like stay in your lane and when the time is right for god to bless you with bigger and better things he will do so okay 
Um, and I'm glad I'm actually at a point where I realize that and I'm okay with that. You know, the space is enough for us. We don't need anything bigger. Um, so yeah, I'm looking forward to it. I'm going to be, like I said, I'm not going to show you an empty apartment tour because there's just too much work. Your girl doesn't have energy for that. But what I'm going to be doing is I'm um, styling the rooms individually or different parts of the house. So we'll do like a, a bathroom reveal um, and show you guys how the bathrooms look when I'm done shopping for or styling it how I want it to look. And I'm going to be bringing you along. So we go shopping for the different things that we need. We, to be honest, we don't need a lot of things. Oh. We don't need a lot of things because we've got a lot of furniture from the previous places. Places. Um, last year we were in a different place and then for the past four years we were in a bigger house. Four bedrooms, three bathrooms. So there's a lot of furniture and two living areas and one, no, two living areas and one dining room. So that house was huge and there's just too much furniture. There's no way any of those things are going to fit here. So we'll probably just bring the couch, coffee table, TV stand, maybe a few side pedestals or plants or whatever to decorate the place. But the rest of the things will probably remain in storage. And then, so we don't need to buy anything new, to be honest. But because we're in a different place and I want to style it differently, I will probably go shopping here and there for new things, small things. The big pieces are not a problem. Um, for just the small things, so that it matches the aesthetic of the place as a, you know, just the overall look. So I'm gonna bring you along every time I go by any deco pieces or any kitchen equipment or stuff like. Already I'm thinking I need to go buy the fatugu, I need to go buy the teaspoon, I need to go buy. I just want like matching cup sets and plates. I kind of feel like I don't want to use some of the old stuff because I feel like new place, new me. <laughs> but those are not priorities to be honest because we already have those things. It's just that I want new ones. Um, so when I do have extra money to spare, I will be going out to buy those things and then decorating and furnishing the place. So I'll bring you guys along for that process. I'm so excited about it. And yeah, um, I can't wait to, to complete it. And hopefully in a month or so, it will start to feel like home where the furniture will all be in. And then I can start seeing exactly what it is that I need to buy. But for now, I, there are definitely a few kitchen stuff that I want to buy um, because we haven't, had, we haven't gone to the storage yet. And a few of these things are a need. So, I don't know if I'm going to do that tomorrow or as the days go. Like, it depends on how I feel tomorrow, to be honest. I'm already so out of breath. I don't know what is wrong with me. Um, so, I just don't see myself right now <laughs> raiding the mall. And anyway, it's not like my budget allows. Guys, deposits will humble you. Next come stay in Cape Town and come pay a de double deposit. Here you're paying... Somebody, like a bond but anyway that's not the point um so tomorrow also i might be doing my nails um they're quite grow well not quite but they have grown for sure and i spoke to my nail tech and just tried to establish if he's got an opening for me for tomorrow he hasn't responded but if he does i'll probably just go do my nails and i feel like my nails just calm me down in a stressful environment or it just makes me happy <laughs> and right now i need something to make me happy so nails it is i'll bring you guys along i hope you enjoy the video please don't forget to like share subscribe and turn on the notification bell so that you get notified every single time i upload a new video you're gonna see a lot of this no makeup scruffy looking girl honey Yo, going through a lot. <laughs> um, yeah, but this is going to be me at home. Like, no fancy business. Like, you know, you're going to see me in my pajamas half of the time. Because at home, who is clothes at home, right? 
<laughs> the only time I change into normal clothes is if I need to go to the shops um, or go pick up the kids from school. Other than that, pajamas all day, honey. Um, but yeah, so basically you're going to see more at home content and I'm excited about that. It's been a while since um, I've been able to actually shoot all of that. So I'll see you guys soon. So here, um, as I'm unpacking, I'm also rinsing and washing some of the stuff because it's been sitting for a bit and some of them are dusty. So I'm just rinsing these forks and knives. And I also actually noticed that we don't have any teaspoons here. So the teaspoons that we have are the small ones for dessert. So I need to add on to what we have. And this is the only big fork and knife that we currently have. Everything else, like I said, is still in storage. All right, so hubby went out to get a few things for us, um, just a few basics from Woolies. So we got these burger patties, plant-based. Um, I've never had these, and to be honest with you, I don't know how I feel about it because I am a huge meat lover. So I don't even know why or how we got to this point of buying <laughs> plant-based products. Um, we got rice, um, which is obviously one of the basic items that we need. We also got some pasta, um, spaghetti, because the kids love spaghetti. And I also appreciate the fact that it's so quick to make. So during the week when I'm coming back from the office and I'm tired, I can just make a quick meal. We also got some chocolate cake mix, which is great and it comes out perfect almost every single time. I really appreciate that you just need a few ingredients such as eggs, milk and oil, then you're done. So 10 out of 10 for me, we've bought it multiple times and it works out every time. So we just got two of those. We will probably make them over the weekend. Um, just some fun activities with the girls. Then Hubby also got some chakalaka chips. I think this is a new flavor for more It was the first time I see it. And the girls were not happy about it because it's spicy, but daddy loves spicy. So yeah, I think he forgot about the girls there. And then we also got some cheese sauce. Um, we got a couple of packs. Um, I think we might make these with some steak or even with the pasta or chicken breasts. We'll see. We also got some garlic infused virgin oil. Garlic is always a win for me. So if I don't have to actually chop up garlic and it's already infused in the oil, that's great. And then lastly, we just added um, some peanuts and raisins. Great snack to have. Okay, so Hubby also went out to get some toiletries or a few things that we needed for the bathroom. Um, we got the kids some foam bath. Um, they currently already have one that they're using, but this is just going to be a top up. And then some hair and body wash as well. And then lastly, we also got a body spray for them. My girls are very girly girl and they would always want to smell good. Um, so this is great because then I don't have to share my perfumes with them. And then just to add on to those, um, we also got some foam box with a little flavor. And then we also got a body wash for the shower. Um, same brand. And then we also got a second um, foam box. These are not very big, so I think it's always best to have more than one for the month. And then we also got um, a fragranced bath oil, just to make sure that the bath smells good and to leave the skin feeling nice and smooth and moisturized. And then lastly, we just got a hand lotion. Um, I'm going to check in the shops um, at other stores if they don't have the hand wash that matches the brand so that we have a hand wash and hand lotion that matches 
Hi guys, so today is Saturday. I spoke to you yesterday, looking all scruffy. Um, so we're at the mall, just about to run a few errands. It's my friend's birthday, so I wanted to see if I can't get her some flowers. And then um, I had a nail appointment for 11, but it's been moved to three o'clock. So while I wait, we're just gonna do um, a window shopping, yeah, and I did to waste it, guys, you know and see what I can get for cheap cheap uh, at Pip Home. Yeah, yeah. But anyway, today I'm not alone. I have company. Drum roll. Ta-da! Say hi. Hello, why do you call you people? They're my people. <laughs> don't, they don't have a name? They don't have a name. They are just my people. My people, my people, my people. Hi, my people. Hi, our people. Are they our people? Mm. Mm. Hi, our people. Our, our Give it to Abandu Yes. So this guy decided to follow me around today. I just asked him for one thing. Ask him take his abut logo. Like I don't want to be uncomfortable. I'm shopping. You know how men. Always go like, ah, are we done yet? I don't need that today. Since he's a guest here, he must comply. Every shop that I say we go into, we must go into. And I mustn't be rushed. Every? Every shop that we go into, I don't want to be rushed today. <clears throat> okay? Understood? Yes, ma'am. Thank you. All right, guys. Um, We dropped off the kids at Andy's place. Um, That's the birthday girl. So... It's just the two of us today. A little bit of quality time, I guess. I don't know how it's quality time if we are running errands, but I guess it also counts as quality time. So we'll see you guys later on. Um, the next time you will see me will probably be at the salon doing my nails. But I'll show you guys what I'm also getting here if I do get anything. We're at Table Bay Mall. It's later. Until later, baby. Lee. Later, <laughs> I get on when you speak to them, you're speaking on my behalf as well. Later, yeah, but so, you can't just keep quiet. <laughs> Even too. Bye bye. Ah, oh, these are nice. You remember we bought this? Yeah, I was about to ask you to buy this. We did. We bought one. Hello. Where is it? It's in storage, no? This is pretty. These are so pretty. Alright, so guys, I am finally done doing my nails. I didn't bring you guys along, you know, 
I didn't feel like going through all that admin. I went very basic, honey. Basic, cute, simple, elegant, cute girl vibe. Okay. Very minimalistic, but practical. I cut them shorter. This is as short as I'm willing to go. Um, but I really like them. They're really cute. So I'm excited. Um, so I'm going home. I'm going to pick up the kids now. Um, and then we're going to get it back home yeah then we're gonna head back home <laughs> um i want to show you guys something but people are looking at me so basically let me give you context quickly before i turn the camera i was saying one day this is going to be me and my friends my new obsession is jaguar the car jaguar so here where i was doing my nails right opposite and I don't know if they're all friends or is this a Mercedes-Benz crew meeting? What is going on? I'm scared to even find out what's going on in there. But I like the fact that they all have the same car. I think it's pretty dope. Childish but dope. <laughs> I don't know who convinced who that we're all going to drive the same car or the car brand. But hey, guys, night. I opt for a Jaguar. So that means all my friends now need to go buy Jaguars once i get one so that we all match <laughs> so let me show you guys what i'm talking about it's raining um today the weather is not the bestest but let me show you quickly hi guys so the time at the moment is half past eight in the evening Lochini just came back it is raining today in cape town which is a nice surprise i wasn't expecting rain today and it's always great if you don't have plans and you're just chilling at home, nice and cozy. I'm in my pajamas. Um, I got this cute gown from Woolworths. So comfy. Hubby got it for me, actually. And it just so happens to match my pajama. I'm like, why are you looking dodgy there in the background? <laughs> um, yeah, so guys, I'm just going to make a quick... Um, dinner i'm gonna make pasta vegetarian pasta because in this household we are now experimenting with being vegan being vegetarian i don't know what's next but to my surprise yesterday when we had the plant-based patties they tasted so good guys i don't know how human beings manage to get plants to taste like meat that is just some weird stuff that i can't get my head around but it was so good so i'm not anymore that opposed to the idea i probably won't like fully go vegan or vegetarian but i actually am once a, a week or twice a week i don't mind us implementing that as a start because there's no way i'm giving up meat and j and j and j and j just yeah but anyway guys let me quickly cook um then we'll probably just go chill and watch a movie or just catch up on youtube videos yes baby mm -hmm. perfectly. you look so beautiful mm -hmm. do you want to come say hi to my youtube can, people can, Mama, the, I can even jump in. Nice. come say hi quickly hi guys i'm my, my baby jeans that do not fit me at mm -hmm. all you were like two when those are the those are like for two year olds. Because yeah. we are busy again, Last still in the process of packing. We got the crescent. I was wearing this, then we went to the park, and then and then Masha was pushing me. Mm. And I don't know if it was you, and then Masha I'm was. To block the lights with my yeah. hand. And then, yeah, and then Masha um, was standing where my feet were, and you were pushing me. Mm. And then she like, yeah, but even the battery is running low. Okay, mama, say bye. I, I was just saying you must come yeah. say hi, not come and speak no. for long. No? Hi, guys. Bye. <laughs> Bye, guys. Let me cook.